I'm going to make a dandelion, a little yellow dandelion on here. Krista Franklin, owner of Once Upon a Time Art Studio, began making woodblock art pieces for kids with cancer about five years ago. I started painting and selling my artwork and then the proceeds I would take and I would make little block pieces for um, kids with cancer for free and um, it kind of took off. Which resulted in her moving into this studio space located above Culture House Coffee on Elm Street in Youngstown. Today the money she raises through her art helps children with cancer and a variety of other causes. I mean it's a list of different things that it's all used for. Franklin says her business of helping people through her artwork stems from her mother who passed away from cancer when Franklin was 12 years old. I always had this passion for like uh, cancer victims and I realized there was a lot of kids with cancer and I wanted to do something in honor of my mother. Franklin has started going on missionary trips to help people in need in other countries. Her trips are funded by the art she sells at her studio. Like everything basically in this studio is handmade except for maybe 10% of the items. I make wood art, that is what I specialize in. People know my studio for it. Um, I take recycled wood because I try to keep things eco-friendly. Um, and I do art on that and I do art requests and I also sell it here uh, for people to come and shop. I also have fair trade items sold here from other countries and uh, just a variety of things. Franklin took her first mission trip to India last August. She hopes to take her second trip there in June. Currently, she's $500 short of her $1,500 goal. In India, we'll be doing a kids festival. We'll be feeding some of the homeless people while we're there. I also will be planting um, gardens in a more poor area so that they can have food of their own. And I wanted to make compost uh, to help with some of the pollution that they have there, getting rid of some of the items that are just tossed. Her next destination is Russia. They asked if I can work um, in an organization that helps kids with cancer. So I'll be teaching them art and I'm a dancer, so I'll teach them dance. And I'll also be working in an orphanage while I'm there. So that will be my next um, one outside of the country. Franklin says in the future she plans on taking mission trips to Malaysia, Indonesia, and Kenya. I want it to grow bigger. Had a few people uh, ask if they could come next year. So I have three people coming with me next year on my mission trip to India. So um, because it's had such a great response, I want to keep it going. If you'd like to check out some of Franklin's artwork or donate to her cause, you can visit her on Instagram or stop into her studio Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. You can also find her artwork at Pat's Antique Shop in Liberty, as well as Cultivate Cafe in Youngstown. Seven Seventeen Credit Union: Savings power to give your business an extra boost. Business savings, certificates, and business money market. 717 Credit Union. Make your money work as hard as you do.